All right, everyone, welcome back again to more Persona 3 Reload. So we finally took care of uh, the week of quiz or exams for that matter. And we also managed to complete another social link that was uh, the star, Hayase. It's already uh, evening at the date of December 19th on a Saturday. We're going to spend some time with Kuromaru over here and continue onwards. What's up? Is that your dog? Wow, he looks like a smart one. Unlike his owner. <laughs> I'm just joking. So, how's life, man? And I love how the girl in that show has this mature vibe. You know what I mean? Whoa, looks like this guy's had his fair share of fun. Guess we should start heading home then. See, it's cool. Kumar and I return to the dorm. Yes? Who is it? Um, it's me. Huh? Oh, come in. You don't stop by very often, Senpai. Is something wrong? No, not particularly. Is this a bad time? Aw, oh, are you feeling lonely? Hey, are you teasing me? Nah, I'd never. <laughs> sure. I wonder what this Nyx is like. Do you think it's inside Tartarus? I have no idea. Oh, by the way, I've made my decision. I want to fight to the end. It's better than doing nothing. That's why you're here, right, Senpai? You got me. <laughs> yeah, you're pretty easy to read. I've made my decision as well. The Kirijo group is slowly regaining its footing. After I graduate, the plan is for me to eventually take over as leader. Turning back was never really an option for me. But what if you die? If we can defeat Nyx and I die in the process, then the company will continue on without me. And I'm confident they'd carry on my wishes. But from what we've heard, Nyx can't be defeated. Though I kind of wonder about that. We've got someone on our team who seems pretty unkillable, too. That's true. And he's an exceptional Persona user, even if death was empowering him from within. He's an interesting guy, huh? He certainly is. You know, if things don't work out, I think I'll still be okay as long as I'm with everyone. Honestly, I don't think it matters if we live or die. All that really matters is that we're proud of how we lived. And I know I'd be proud if we decided to fight Nyx. Is this about honoring your father's legacy? Yeah, that's part of it. But mostly, it's about me and how I feel. I understand. Senpai, a while back, you asked me to face what comes next with you. You didn't forget, did you? I could never forget. We'll fight together, Yukari. Good. I gotta say, that was a nice little bonding moment between Yukari and uh, Mitsuru. <clears throat> Alright, let me check this out. It's Sunday, perfect. What you got? It's amazing! Good, good. A pink duffel coat, along with. Not bad, kid! A Shiroko can. Okay, cool. Bad. 
Thanks, kid. Bub All right, so now I have to definitely go to the shrine. Boost up Fuka's uh, support for me or our relationship. And since I'm already here, duplicate some skills. And I went to the wrong spot. We make. We'll go magic this time. And oh yes, um, Buffy dying. Excellent. All right, perfect. All right, yep, yep, yep. Draw fortune, and we'll do Buka. I've drawn my fortune. I hope I can deepen my bond. I hear a divine message. Blessings to the believer. Oh good. So close to Puka. You have little luck. Oh, that's... Well, I found something. I was so low. Uh, that's what everyone has to say. Yeah. It's not just me. It's not like me to just give up. No matter what the outcome is, I want to know what I fought for my future. That's why I've decided. I suppose. I have no choice but to go on. The answer's right in front of me the entire time. Yes. If I don't make it, then someone else will have to take over the company. Although I have every intention of returning. I mean, we're 11 days away from the next full moon too. Can I help you? I just want to talk. By the way... Oh, it's almost Christmas. Hey, Satokun, what do you think the real meaning of Christmas is? Peace on Earth, joy to the world, consumerism. Ah, both of these. Even this little bit. Why, certainly. That's one way to look at it. I have a similar mindset, actually. I believe that the Christmas spirit should put a smile on everyone's faces. So let's be happy, too. How about you? By the way... It's almost Christmas, isn't it? It's like I was sleepwalking. With so much going on, I almost forgot about Christmas. What's everyone else doing here? Second floor. Oh, they're chilling upstairs. Hey, Koromaru. Of course. Gotta pet you, buddy. Oh, he gave his paw. That's nice. Koromaru seems more determined than usual. Hey there. I wonder what Mochizuki's doing right now. Maybe he's cursing fate. Why does he even care about life on Earth? Hmm. I don't even want to think about it. No matter what we do, we can't stop it from happening. It's just not fair. <laughs> I wish I could just forget about it too. But the promised day will eventually come. There's no escaping it. Dude, you're a downer, you know that? By the way, <laughs> those Strega dumbasses haven't made a move yet, huh? They better hurry up and show their faces. I don't know what they're up to, but I'm gonna crush them either way. Yeah. I'm with you there. I'm not gonna let them get away after what they did to Shinji and Chidori. <laughs> Looks like Koromaru's on board too, aren't you, bud? Alright, well, let's take the night off. Hey, the exam results are up. I scored the highest in my grade. Everyone's looking at me with respect. So weak. Come to think of it, Mitsuru promised to give me a gift if I scored well. I should talk to Mitsuru when I see her. Most time's almost over. I should get back to class. I wonder if Fuka's available on a Monday. I always forget. All right, class is starting. We're a little ahead of schedule, so let's do some review. When you see electromagnetism, Lorentz's force and Fleming's left hand rule should come to mind right away. I won't give partial credit if you write right hand rule, got it? 
Okay, moving on. Sleepy again. What's up? Sorry, what was that again? The law of happiness without hard work? Uh, do you really think I'll give you credit for calling some goofy wish a law? I'm clearing the blackboard now. Hurry up and write. Yep, time to stay up. Is available. Oh, Fuka now. Something fucking perfect. Alright. I believe I'm like two away with three away with Fuka. As well as with Mitsudu. And I have five with the fortune dude. So I'm hoping I can finish those three up. Oh, hi. Are you heading home? Did you happen to be free today? I was hoping you could join me for something. Do it. Uh -huh. Thank you. I hope no one's sitting at our usual spot. So, I tried putting my thoughts in order. I was so confused last time. I couldn't find the right words. I've said before, but I have a bad habit of thinking negatively. Like when I have a difficult time deciding on something. But no one knows what the future holds. No matter how much you prepare, you can never really be sure what'll happen. So in situations like that, I think the most important thing you can do is believe. You have to think positively and trust that the future will smile upon you. The thing is, I'm not sure I can do that. I don't understand how it comes so naturally to everyone else. How are you able to tell yourself that things will work out in the end? I believe in myself. It's just my personality. I never really thought about it. Well, I believe in myself. Oh, I see. You really are strong. I really admire that part of you. So, um... The reason I've been relying on you isn't just because you're our leader. It's because... You're you. It needs to be you. I understand Fuka's heartfelt words. It seems you've grown closer. Two more away. You know, sometimes I think to myself, once I learn how to cook and I've paid you back for your help, will that be the end of us spending time together like this? We we'll see each other in the dorm. Not at all. Thank you. But I'm sure there are lots of other people who depend on you, right? I can't get in the way of that. Sorry, I didn't mean to sound so depressed. Oh, well, look at the time. We should start heading back. Hey, uh, do you mind if we'd make a small detour? I want to buy some ingredients. I think I'll tackle making Koro-chan's dinner today. I went shopping with Fuka, then head home. Today is December 21st, just 10 days until New Year's Eve, but for some reason I'm actually not scared at all. Well, maybe I shouldn't say at all, but I think I'm okay now. Hey, um... I'm gonna fight. Whether we'd win or lose, I don't know. But I want to know that I did everything I could. Very brave of you. Very, very brave. I don't have to go to any of these places anymore. Thank a goodness. Um... Let's talk. <laughs> Hi there. The exam results are out, so that's one less thing for us to worry about. Now, what should I do for Christmas? Alright, let's go here. Yeah. 
I was just thinking about something. Now that our exams are done, I can't stop thinking about the decision we have to make. This is even harder than studying for exams. Oh yeah! Christmas is almost here. Are you excited for it? Of course. Hell yeah! Cool, let's enjoy Christmas. <laughs> Alright. Spend time with Komaru. It is. We'll be right here. So go play all you want, okay? Recently, I found a recipe for a cake that you can bake with nothing but a microwave. You know, since it's almost Christmas, I wanted to try making something to get in the spirit of things. And depending on the ingredients I use, I might even be able to give some to Koro-chan. something in his mouth. I got speed incense. Hmm. I wonder where he keeps finding all this. Oh no, Kuro-chan! Your butt's all dusty now! I guess we should take a bath together again. <laughs> Let's head back. We're nearing Christmas. Good morning. This is Elizabeth. I am calling to inform you that more humans have wandered into Tartarus. God, they still do that? <laughs> Two this time, I believe. Please swiftly and safely conduct a search and rescue. Goodbye now. At least just two. It's not that bad. Well then. It's chilly today. Ara Gibo Leo Alam Adonai. Miss Onishi left early today, so I'll be filling in for her. I think today we'll learn about near death experiences. There's no real reason for it. They've just been on my mind lately. Now, a near death experience is defined as something an individual undergoes just before death. Is it true insight into the afterlife or simply a trick of the brain? Opinions vary, but it's certainly true that near death experiences have been a hotly debated topic for some time. There are actually a few surviving records of ancient near-death experiences. According to the writings of Plato, a resuscitated soldier experienced the afterlife as a spirit. A similar incident was reported in Japan by ethnologist Kunio Yanagita in the Tono Monogatari. Psychologist Carl Jung wrote that in his own near-death experience, he saw a vision of the world from afar. I'm sure you've heard your own stories, whether by famous or ordinary individuals. I have a few first-hand reports with me today. Let me read you some of them. I felt as if my soul was detached from my body. I met a friend who had already passed away. I saw my whole life flashing before my eyes. I saw the most brilliant light. I was bathed in pure light. My body was brimming with happiness. This feeling of pure joy is also known as euphoria. At any rate, these kinds of reports are typical for the experience. Some people have actually attempted to make direct recordings of near-death experiences. Researcher Kenneth Ring has tried to quantify near-death experiences with a weighted core experience index. Modern efforts have led a new theory of near-death experiences, which goes like so. If an individual is dying, yet denies that fact, they'll eventually come to realize that death is a reality they must accept and become upset. As a result, they'll try to do anything they can to extend their life, but the futility this leads to depression. In the end, they accept their fate. Although we may initially deny death, we'll accept it in the end. That's just how we humans are. Is everyone listening? It's not every day that you hear a lesson like this. <laughs> How about I test to see if you're paying attention? Get it wrong and your memories of life at school will disappear. Hmm. Now, who should I pick? I choose D, Arisato. What do we call the feeling of joy that comes from near death experience? Euphoria, Utopia, Yugoslavia. Euphoria. Correct. Good work. That is correct. You'll have a happy school life. Some people say a near death experience awakens one's higher consciousness. Whether or not that's true, there is an observably lower fear of death found in those who have endured one. Perhaps this is because near-death experiences are surprisingly free of pain and suffering. But this is not to say I'd want any of you to seek one out. Use the time you have here wisely, okay? Well, that's all for today. Class is dismissed. Alright. Got it right again.
Oh, he's up. Alright. Okay, not this time. Alright, we're gonna... For now, we'll go to... Main Lobby. We'll be up with Fortune Dude. Let me see if I can speak to Mitsudo and see... It might be too late, though. Oh. Arisato. I saw your exam results. Good work. It's admirable how you continue to excel in school while fighting arduous battle after battle. Excellent. I got you a gift to acknowledge all your hard work. Here, take it. Master Incense. Since I got placed at the top in the exams, I also got this Phoenix Charm. Ooh. Alright. Let's save again. As much as I want to speak to Mitsuru, and I'm only three away from her too, I need to get this guy up to par. What up, dude? I feel as if we can grow closer thanks to the fortune percent on Tropos. Let's do it. We're nine days away. Scratching the off pencils echoes throughout the art room. Do you have some time to chat after art club? Everyone's working so hard. What's the matter? So are you. Is that what it seems like to you? That I'm working hard? Well, I told my dad about studying abroad. He said I should give it a try. And just the other day, he was telling me to quit. He's always wanted me to be a doctor till now. So for him to say that, I just don't know what to think. Are you study abroad? Well, that's your choice now. Yeah, that's true. But at the same time, if I study abroad, it kind of feels like I'm doing it because that's what my dad wants. Thanks. This has been eating me up for a while, and it feels good to talk about it. You're really the only one I can talk to about this stuff. Hiraga expressed his gratitude to me. I feel like we're becoming better friends. It's great that you've always made your own decisions. Not like me, though. Sorry, we should get going. My driver's picking me up, so I can have him drop you off near your dorm if you want. <laughs> Sweet. There's a box on the counter. Looks like the product they ordered to the shopping program on TV has arrived. Back. Right, let's see how that. Hold on a second. Let's get rid of this. All right. Now, with pink duffel coat. Whoa. Good for her. Our god armor. Alright, cool, she's good. Alright. Um we need to go to Tartarus. I suppose. I have no choice but to go on. The answer was right in front of me the entire yes. time. If I don't make it, then someone else will have to take over the company. Although I have every intention of returning. See, that's the positive attitude we need these days. Um Let's go to Tartarus. Some people can't make it today, but would you still like to go? Of course. Yes. Oh, yes. May I have a moment of your time? 
Taurus appears to have a special little guest today. In between its jaws, it clenches a fragment that emits a curious blue light. Should your curiosity get the best of you, perhaps it would be best to pay this guest a visit. I believe it will likely be on floor 190. Off you go. Well, last time, you gave me misinformation. And I did not want to go in there. Alright, hold on a second, Elizabeth. Good day. Missing persons. I can sense a present. There seems to be a human presence within Tarvis Floors between 204 to 11. Oh, yes. Low guess 190. Okay. Not worried. Very well. I'm going to the cat first, of course. Floor 190. Time to get to work. Hey, I faint reading up a living thing. It could be a person, so please try looking for them. Okay. Alright, we found the cat. Oh, there's a treasure chest. Oh, hold on. Turn around. Perfect. Weak to fish. Okay. I can take over any time. What are they thinking? Please explain it. Leave it to you. You take the best. What's next? Better be watching shoes and battles. Mostly battles. Dress like this. Ow. Wow. Good job, enemy down. It's all yours. I got it. Which one of you has a fish move? I know I have at least one. There you go. This is it. Oh my goodness. That's a win for the team! Right. Good job, everyone! That was unbelievably powerful. Magarula, or this one. Okay, let's keep on exploring. Right, now, where is that cat? Oh, found them. If we all go on a trip together, I bet the journey would be just as fun as the destination. Yeah, totally. We'd stuff our faces with snacks and play card games. It'd be a blast. Alright. There's a cat that looks nice and docile. What? Yeah, let's head back. I'm so relieved you were able to save that kitty. It can stay here for now. We'll send it off safely when the time comes. Alright, what floor do we need to go for the people? Good day. Missing person. I can sense a presence. It seems to be human present 204 and 211. Okay, got you. Very well. Let's hope you're not uh, misleading me. Um. I'm getting a reading of a person. Please go secure them right away. Um. I'm sure there's someone here. Check everywhere, please. We're doing well. Let's keep up the pace. Well, it could be on the left side. Nope. Hey, there's a treasure chest. Oh, at least you found some treasure. All right, maybe straight ahead. Uh-oh. We got ourselves a shadow here. Oh boy. They don't seem very strong. Weak to dark. Revolution, 
money helps. That was excellent leadership. Keep up the good work. All right. Oh, another one. Shadow spotted. What's the plan? Well, my plan is for it to turn around, but we'll see. Taking sweet time. Alright, then we'll leave it to the two. I'm ready to go. I'll take care of this. I'll hit them where it hurts. I'll show no mercy. That was great, no. Ichiru Senpai. Here we come. Hey, don't you dare run. Out of my sight. Alright, we'll go for my health. No. Money. Perfect coordination. Let's do the same thing for our next fight. Wait, nope, 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 nope. Where haven't I checked? Oh, down there. Someone's over. Alright, that must be one of the people who went missing. We need to provide treatment immediately. Please return to the entrance. Yep, let's do it. Yes. Alright. Should be one more left. Good day. I can sense a presence. 219 and 224. All right. Now, thank you for that. Very well. We'll find them. Um. Found the last one. We're doing well. Let's keep up the pace. That's what we're trying to do. Hmm. I probably should have went down that corner, but it's okay. Uh-oh. Is that treasure? Yes. Ooh, we what are, are you weak against? I guess we'll find out. Nope. What's the plan here? This should be a good test of your strength. But don't get careless. Mm. This should be a good test of your strength. But don't get careless. Uh, kind of just want to take them down. Money and deflect on magic. I'll take this one. All right, then moving on. Wait, what? I'm missing a chest. Oh, careful. The enemy's nearby. Not you. <laughs> he ran away from me, too. Oh, found them. Went the okay. wrong way. Wandering around like a clown. Where are you hiding? Over here. Someone. Um. 
All right, we did it. Yes. <sighs> Are we good? Are we good? Okay, let's double check with uh, Elizabeth. Good day. Okay, we're good. Very well. All right, we can leave. Oh, hello. I thought you were going to go visit your mother's grave. Sonata-san. You sure this is where you want to be? Well, I was planning on visiting her. But when I thought about what I was going to say to her, it just didn't feel right. I've still got unfinished business to take care of first. Yeah, I know what you mean. I don't have anything to tell Shinji right now. I've got my own stuff to deal with. An unbeatable enemy, huh? I wonder what it's like. Beats me. It doesn't matter, though. I've already made up my mind. I don't care what I'm up against. I'm gonna look it straight in the eyes. Straight in the eyes. I like the sound of that. You can count me in, too. All right. Looks like those two found their resolve. Today's the emperor emperor's birthday. No school. Okay. That's a Wednesday. All right. Um. Well, if that's the case, then let me just do this. Take another copy. Magic. And give me... Yeah, this one. Alright. Honestly, I don't know what I can do now. Because we're off. That's like a waste of a day. Now, what do you have to say, Mitsuru? Let's see. Don't think of this as our last Christmas. Simply think of it as this year's Christmas and enjoy it. Well, yeah, that's a good way to put it. Maru. All right, let's save. Eight more days until New Year's Eve. I saw the sun. Do you know what you'll decide yet? Well, I. I'm gonna fight. I was thinking about it a lot, but then I realized there wasn't much to think about. I mean, I can't tell my mom and Aragaki son that we failed, so that's that. Alright, alright. What about you, Yukari? By the way. The other day I was flipping through a magazine when I saw this poll. It was about how much money people want their partners to spend on their Christmas presents. I'm usually interested in that kind of thing, but not right now. Okay. I guess stuff like money and presents doesn't feel like it matters a whole lot anymore, huh? Well, especially what we're going through. Let's do this. Haru-chan always looks so happy when we're on break. 
Maybe it's because everyone's all together. Okay, Koro-chan. Go run to your heart's content. Hey, so... Weird question, but... You do know what day tomorrow is, right? I'm gonna have something ready just in case. So, you know, if you have time... Well... I'll tell you the rest tomorrow. <laughs> oh, there you are. <laughs> and you've got something again, don't you? Is that an early Christmas present for us? Garden sets. Koro chan, were you digging around again? Your nose is all dirty. Come here. Let's get you cleaned up before we go home. Today is December 24th, Christmas Eve, an important day in Europe and America. Although unlike in Japan, December 25th Christmas Day is even more important. Do you all know why we celebrate the holiday in the first place? In Japan, Christmas Eve is just a day for couples to spend time together and give gifts. I'm feeling sleepy. Nasty way. So that's why. And then beneath the largest, most beautiful fur, we made a vow to love each other unconditionally forever and ever. The twinkling lights from the trees dance upon our faces as we gaze into each other's eyes. So romantic. I got a few messages. Our first. Uh oh. <laughs> Our first Christmas, did I send it too early? I really want to spend time with you today. The day it is. I just wanted to say for fun. I know I don't usually say these kinds of things, but since it's a pretty special day, I thought maybe we could spend it together, like how the people do. So these are the people when I left it open for uh, being in a relationship with. When I decided to be in a relationship with them. I should I spend time with? Why would I want to spend time alone? Let's go with Yukari. My plans for Christmas have been set. Shall we get going? We don't have all night, you know. There's still a curfew. Hey, let's go to Polonia Mall! I hear they're gonna have lights up. Everything must feel so different under that kind of atmosphere. To be honest, I've been looking forward to it. I decided to spend Christmas Eve with Yukari. Oh, it's so pretty! This is wonderful! It's beautiful, what next? Yeah, I could look at this all night long. Did you know they brought in a famous designer for these decorations? Here, I have a present for you. It's been a while since I've made something like this. Chocolate cake. I hope it tastes all right. Should I give something? What do I have? Oh, I do have all these. Thank goodness. Brand wallet, perfume, brand purse. I'll give it to her. Oh, is that for me? This is... How did you... Oh, wow. I can't believe it. I owe you big time. Next year, I'm gonna get you something really nice. Thank you. The car seems thrilled with the present. Honestly, when I first met you, I never thought we'd end up spending Christmas together like this. I was just so used to being all on my own. I'm only gonna tell you this because it's a special day, but I actually always dreamed of doing something like this. 
I know that with everything going on, it's not exactly the time to be getting all warm and fuzzy. But one night couldn't hurt, right? Just for today. I want to be by your side. I shared a tender moment with Yukari. Look at those people taking pictures in the background. Or at least it looks like they're taking pictures. Well, I'm sure it's fine. We can't be the only ones staying out late on a day like this, right? Except for Junpei, I guess. I can't imagine him having a romantic evening out. Uh, sorry, that isn't the point. I just want to stay with you a little longer. Hey, are you cold? It's chilly, right? Can I come closer? I was hoping you could keep me warm, maybe. Spend time with your car until night fell. Oh, she's available. Cool. Alright, let me do a quick save here. Oh, wait, no. Over here. Alright. Alright, Fuka. Hey, no. Sato, are you busy today? If not, do you think we can chat on the roof for a day? Do it. Thank you. I'd like to go to the roof then, shall we? So, um, please don't laugh at this, okay? The other day, I let Yukari-chan try a new dish I made. She liked it so much, she ended up eating it all. So I told her it was meant to return the favor for what everyone's done for me. But she got really confused and asked me what favor this was about. It didn't seem like she had any idea what I was talking about, so I told her the whole story. And when I finished, she burst out laughing. She told me I didn't need to do anything like that. She said, when you're friends, you don't keep score. <laughs> That's funny. Nah, she's right. so negative this whole time I felt like I needed to be useful to belong here even though that wasn't true at all it was just what I was telling myself I was being blinded by my fear but understanding this made me realize what I really wanted to do I've been going on about wanting to repay everyone for what they've done for me but the real reason is a lot more simple so, um, will you hear me out? Normally, I'd ask your opinion on how best to do something like this, but... <sighs> I... I want you by my side. I want to be together with you. Forever. Wait, they're all the same. <laughs> understood what I meant just now. I better choose my words carefully here. <sighs> I treat you right. <clears throat> yes, no matter what happens, I'll be by your side. As long as I have you, I feel like I can handle anything. Um. I 
love you. Puka expressed her feelings for me. I've entered a special relationship with Puka. It seems like it's a final, but it's only a nine, right? Yeah, that's funny. It's the chime signaling the end of the school day. Oh, the time. Do you think maybe we could keep talking for a little longer? So today's December 25th, but all this talk about death and fate, what a depressing Christmas. Christmas will be better next year. That's right, I said it, next year. We're not gonna let the world end. Optimistic, I love it. <clears throat> Alright guys, on that note, I'm gonna end it here for today. I wanna thank you all for watching. We are six days away to the next full moon, or should I say, when uh, Ryoji drops by again to give us a chance to make our decision. So, if anything else, We'll continue on in the next one. So thank you again for watching.